This is my review of Spider-Man Web Battlers action figure. This is a bootleg Spider-Man Web Battlers action figure. As you can see, he's got a very nice uh, details. Uh, for a bootleg, he's not a bad figure, but obviously he doesn't have the articulation as the original Web Battlers um, Spider-Man. But yeah, this is pretty cool to see uh, how these web battlers are made in bootlegs uh, and also the price of these web battlers is pretty cheap so let's start with the details so for the details we got the spider-man web as you can see which is pretty cool pretty nice you got the spider logo which is pretty cool then we got the um, the webs which is pretty cool you got the spider webs on the side you got some spider webs on his fingers you got spider logo on the back the spider kind of thing on his um, waist and then black color which is pretty cool we really like the black color white color black color so yeah and then red color so for the details he does look like the ultimate spider-man uh, character so for let's go for the articulation so for articulation uh, his head it can rotate 360 but it's stiff um, he can rotate his hand 360 um, let's remove this and he can bend and he's got this web sticks and you can and as overall I would say um, also he can bend and he's got rotation on the hand legs so I would overall I would say this is not a bad figure for a bootleg but be, keep in mind that these have this figure does not have articulation on the legs and swivels on the side and he has like this baton like thing and he can stand properly sometimes um, but some so you have to fix his legs and since he's a knockoff of web battlers uh, this is what he looks and also he can he comes with his baton so he has cupped hands on that um, this is not a bad figure but overall as a figure I would say this is not a that much a playable figure since this was supposed to be a knockoff of a you know some play feature spider-man figures for kids so that's my review